Hey there, thanks for joining us for this week's edition of the TCM Import. I'm Ben Mankiewicz. Tonight, from Japanese director Yasujiro Ozu in 1959, it's Good Morning, a look at an increasingly westernized Japan through the eyes of two young boys. Of the three 20th century Japanese directors best known in the West, Kenzi Mizuguchi, Akira Kurosawa, and Yasujiro Ozu, Ozu is the least well known, but the respect he's earned from film fans and scholars takes a back seat to no one. For years though, Ozu's films were rarely seen outside of Japan. Unlike the other two world famous Japanese directors, Ozu's narratives and style seem to some too Japanese, that is, not Western enough to deliver a worldwide audience. But Good Morning is considered the wild card of Ozu's career, the one film that looks the least like his others. The story is set in the 1950s in a Tokyo suburb that's becoming increasingly Americanized. That's where we meet two young boys who desperately want a TV set. When their father won't buy them one, they decide to stop speaking completely to everyone except each other until they get that TV. And that sets off a chain reaction of misunderstanding that ultimately pits neighbor against neighbor. From 1959, here's this week's TCM Import. Here's Yasujiro Ozu's Good Morning. 